The Samsung Galaxy S6 Active is pretty much the exact same as the regular S6, except that it is on steroids and plated in armor. I'm Jessica Dahlcourt for CNET. I'm gonna show you what's different about this phone. First of all, we do have this thick plastic rim around the edge and these physical buttons on the bottom and on the sides. They play a really important role in keeping this phone sturdy. There's no glass, there's no metal, it is just plastic and it's supposed to be. The phone does feel pretty grippy because it's got these indentations all along the rim and there's texturing on all of the buttons, which are very responsive. I really like using them. I think they're kind of fun, even if you don't live an active lifestyle, whatever that means. Unlike the S6, the Active is waterproof for 30 minutes and up to three feet of water. It is also dust resistant and it is resistant to drops for up to four feet, but I wouldn't recommend trying it out on purpose. It's nice that there's no flap over the charging port in this version, unlike previous versions. There's also wireless charging included, just like in the S6. See this bright blue button here on the side? This is the convenience key that launches the activity tracker. You press it once to get to the Activity Zone app that has weather, a stopwatch, S Health for your pedometer, a flashlight, a whole bunch of other things, or you can long press it to pull up another app. In this case, I've got music because I like to listen to music when I run, but the beauty of both of these functions is that you can program pretty much any app to launch. And just remember, you can still double tap on the home button to launch the camera. There's also a bigger battery on the S6 Active than with the normal S6, but otherwise the specs are pretty much the same. You've got your 5.1 inch screen with a monster resolution, 16 megapixel camera on the back, five megapixel camera on the front, and an Android 5.0 lollipop inside. The phone does feel grippy in my hand. It's a little bit wider than the regular S6. There are these little rivet looking things on the back, but they're purely for decoration. This is an embedded device, so you can't pop anything off the back cover. There are definitely some features on here that would help you out if you are active, but I think that the S6 Active is a really fun high-end phone to use no matter what your lifestyle. I'm Jessica Dahlcourt for CNET. Make sure that you read my full S6 Active review at CNET.com.